Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show how to create an Instagram bot with the help of Python and Selenium. Basically what the Instagram bot will do means, it will automatically type my username as well as uh, my password I mentioned here and it will automatically click the login button and it will automatically redirect to my login page with the help of uh, this program and here there is no manual effect and everything will be automated with the help of this program now coming to the program first we are using two libraries the first one is selenium and the second one is time first the selenium library used for to perform the automation task and the second library time the time library mostly used to give the delay in your program uh, that's all about the libraries then coming to the program here I specified uh, two strings the first string is username uh, the username is nothing but uh, my Instagram username and I specified my password also so this is my Instagram password uh, I am giving that as a string and after that what I am doing I am you can see chrome is equal to webdriver dot chrome inside that i specified the path of uh, path for where my chrome driver is stored so if you don't know what is chrome driver means please kindly refer my previous video i explained about uh, what is chrome driver and uh, how to set the path for chrome driver in our windows system so you can refer that uh, video in my description also i will paste the link in my description as well as you can get it from the title card and uh, that's all about uh, the chrome driver and here i am specifying one seconds delay after that what i am giving is chrome dot maximize window so what is the meaning for this line is when the python opens the google chrome it is in minimized position so minimized position means it's uh, look like this so it's not uh, convenient to look like this that's why i am trying to convert this window into maximized window so for converting this uh, minimized to maximized state we will use this line chrome dot maximize window so it will automatically uh, maximize the window in order to view the content properly then the next line chrome dot dot and inside that i am specified uh, what uh, website i am going to navigate so here i am going to uh, navigate uh, instagram website because uh, i am going to uh, log in my username as well as password uh, in instagram website only that's why i specified uh, instagram web address here and the chrome dot uh, get will navigate to that particular web address and here i am giving a four seconds delay after uh, accessing to the instagram website it will wait for four seconds and after that uh, four seconds what it will do means so i will explain that uh, open your chrome and uh, use this web address in order to automate first we need to locate this text box so for that go to developer mode for that uh, you can go to setting then more tools and developer tools okay so first we need to locate these two boxes in order to enter the username as well as password automatically so click this button and uh, we first we will locate this uh, username box click that if you want to locate uh, any text box means we will use uh, mostly three methods the first one is uh, name or else you can use id or else you can use the class name or you can use uh, uh, xpath also in order to locate the text box so here i am going to uh, access uh, with the help of name so i am going to locate the text box user uh, username text box with the help of name so after clicking this 
you can see here um, name is equal to username so you need to specify the username in your program um, you can see here chrome dot find element by name so what is the meaning for this line is it will try to locate the element with the help of name so inside that you need to specify the name for that so there name is a username so you need to provide the same username here otherwise it will throw some error and after locating this text box we need to uh, enter the username automatically in the text box for that we will use a username dot send key so what it will do means send keys will automatically send the string into that text box so here uh, in username text box this test dot account will be automatically typed with the help of uh, selenium and after typing the username we need to access the password text box for that again click this and again click this text box password text box and here also i am going to access the password text box with the help of name only so you can see uh, here name is equal to password and uh, yeah here chrome dot find element by name so here also i am going to locate that uh, text box with the help of name only and inside that i need to specify the name of the element and the name of the element is password so you can check here password and that's all so after uh, locating the text box we need to type the password and for that we will use dot send keys and inside that i specified a password so here uh, it uh, here its password is available so what it will do means it will automatically send the my instagram password to that this text box so it will done by automatically with that help of the program and after accessing these two text box we need to click this login button so now we need to locate this login button for that click that and here i am going to uh, locate that login button with the help of uh, xpath so it is uh, another type uh, you can also use a uh, name to locate that uh, text box but here i am going to locate that uh, login button with the help of uh, xpath for that click here then go to copy then copy the full xpath okay after copying the xpath then paste it here okay so this is the xpath for the login button and you can see here i changed the xpath and here uh, its name and here its xpath because uh, here i am going to locate that button with the help of xpath but in previous uh, text box we used uh, name to locate the password as well as the username text box that's the different and after locating the login button we need to click that so we need to click that means we won't do manually it will done automatically with the help of uh, selenium for that we will use this command dot click and dot click will automatically click the login button okay that's all and now i'm going to run this program so before running the program we'll close this uh, chrome and after running this program everything will be automated with the help of this uh, python as well as uh, the help of selenium i will show that and it will automatically type the username automatically type the password and it will automatically log into my account so let's see so this is a minimized state and it will be converted to maximized state see it will be done automatically and after four seconds it will type the username as well as password then it will click the login button automatically i didn't do anything so this is how the instagram bot will work and now i'm going to click this not now so 
so you can see uh, everything is automated with the help of this selenium and python and this code uh, is used to create the instagram login bot if you have any doubts or any queries means please uh, contact me in comment section and i will clear that thanks for watching keep supporting us thank you